Hello, my name is Victoria. Welcome to my channel. I am currently losing weight using Optavia. This week I lost two pounds for a total of 97.8 pounds, and I am getting very close to my next milestone, which is 100 pounds, and I'm very excited for that. Last week I had a little bit of a weight gain, which um, I believe was due to expending more calories than I ate, a lack of sleep, which also plays a role in whether um, I lose weight or not, and also a change in my routine. So this past week, I worked really hard on getting more sleep, not expending more calories than I'm eating, and I also adjusted my routine to fit in our current summer schedule. Four weeks ago, when I had that weight gain and the change um, in my schedule and everything, I was very hungry almost all week. So that by the time I had weigh-in day, I had decided that I didn't care if I went off plan and got out of fat burn. Well, by the time I made the video and I had time to think about it, I did, had decided that I was not gonna do it, that it wasn't worth it. I had even gone so far as to save a piece of wedding cake and a cookie from a reception that I had gone to. I threw those away. I was gonna go out to eat and have something that, um, a salad that consisted of a tortilla, it also had tortilla chips on top and some off-plan dressing, and I decided against that. Um, what I did do though was I did eat quite a bit more than I normally do. I just decided I was not going to go another day and be hungry because that's a recipe for disaster. I could feel myself starting to slip and wanting to binge. So um, I did eat quite a bit more. I didn't even track what I ate. Um, I had was making up some turkey sausage. I ate that till I felt satisfied. I had two built bars um, for two of my fuelings. The, these built bars were 140 calories each. Later on, I had a egg witch, which I'm gonna show you in a minute, along with um, some mushrooms. And later, I had made some Instapot chicken for my family and I ate that till I felt satisfied. So one thing I do have to say is I did not go to bed hungry that night. The rest of the week, I had salads for the remainder of the week and I'm down um, two more pounds. Today, I'm going to show you um, some of my favorite things to eat for green and greens and um, a few of my favorite condiments. I went to Costco yesterday and there's some tried and true things that I like and I picked up a couple of new things that I still need to try out, but I'm still gonna share with you. So the first thing um, that I'm going to share with you are these egg witches. And um, not only do I really like them, but my whole family likes them. And so instead of a bun, you have um, eggs and in between the eggs, you have a turkey sausage and some cheese. It does have 12 grams of fat in it, so I do not have any fats to go along with. Okay, next I have the Kevin's Lemongrass Chicken. And I really like these meal kits because um, the chicken's already pre-cooked, the sauce is already in there, very easy to prepare and very delicious. They have a variety of flavors and um, you can even go to Kevin's online and order some online and I know there's a few local grocery stores that sometimes carry them. Another find is this Tyson's Blackened Chicken Breast Strips. I got this at the last trip that I went to in Costco and my family loved it so much that I picked up three bags today. You can have three ounces of this chicken for 110 calories. So I um, have about six ounces of that along with one fat. Um, next up, I picked up these giant mushrooms so that I can use them as a bun and put my favorite meat in those. Um, a lot of you already know this, I love the Kirkland guacamole cups. So one cup is two fats and I usually have one of these with my salads. This is something that I haven't tried yet. It is um, green salsa and red salsa fresh and it's a combo pack. And I'm act very excited to try this. I thought maybe what I would do is the black and chicken strips are somewhat spicy. So I thought I would have 
um, my blackened chicken strips, my side salad, and put um, the salsa on as in place of a dressing. The um, next thing I wanted to show you is one of my new favorites. It's this flavored peanut butter, and it's from the Flavor PB Company. So um, this particular one is the coconut chocolate flavor, and I love to have that with my dark chocolate Optavia shake. And another one of my favorite combinations is the party cake flavor with a vanilla shake. What I do is I put um, one and a half teaspoons in my shake because you can have one tablespoon of peanut butter powder for a condiment. So that way I get two shakes that have a little bit of that peanut butter and whatever flavor that I choose. And um, again, I really, really, really love that. That's one of my new favorites. And I also like to make Optavia candy bars out of it. So I thought um, it would be fun to just show you some of my favorites, what I do for my Lena Greens and a few of the other things. I hope you have a wonderful day and until next time.